middle of the silver class. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, she's on the way down. Here comes Jackie B. She comes down on the back side. Continuing out to the right hand side of the aerobatic box. Going back on that stick that comes out of the floorboard between her knees. Experiencing some seven times the pull of gravity. On the 45 degree down line, she rolls the aircraft upright. Coming across those center. Diving a little bit. Now pull it up. There's eight times her normal body weight. Eight Gs. Straight up into the beautiful blue skies here at Peoria. She rolls the airplane, running it out of airspeed. Watch her continue to roll the airplane as it slows down. This is called a torque roll. The airplane is turned the opposite way of the motor. She's back through 60, 65 miles an hour backwards, and the nose flops out. As the Arrow Stars come back in, give them a wave, ladies and gentlemen, as they come into their parking place as well. Now, Jackie sets up for her next maneuver on the left-hand side as she does. She's going to set up for what they call the half-square loop, half-roll. Pushes the nose forward, accelerates swiftly through 175 miles per hour. Straight up. A quarter of a roll. Shield your eyes from the sun. She's right in it now. I can't even see what she's doing. Bad placement for me. Comes out. Heads straight to the ground. And now pulls toward the right. Jackie's interest from an early age during the 100th anniversary of Powered Flight 2003, she retired from the legal profession and realized her dream of becoming an air show pilot. She holds the distinction of being the first female pilot to enter this business at 50 years young. She's logged over 1,500 hours of flying time on a variety of aircraft, including a Stearman, an AT-6 Texan, a Beechcraft King Air, a Baron, a Bonanza, both also made by Beechcraft, and a Rocket Champ, a Centabria, a Decathlon, a Lance Air, a Sukhoi, and an extra 300. But her favorite aircraft is this unique Pitts S1T. Her Red Eagle is one of three pits built to fly an air show around the Statue of Liberty during the 1986 Centennial Celebration, which followed Ms. Liberty's refurbishing. The paint motif is both beautiful and patriotic. Jackie currently holds a commercial certificate in land-based aircraft, as well as a seaplane rating, and holds an unrestricted Level 1 Aerobatic Competency Evaluation card. As she does, the centrifuge rolls all the way across the show line. She earned her private pilot's license in June of 1987 in Spokane, Washington. Up over the top. Comes down almost straight down with a half a roll. Getting set up on our 500 foot reference line. Diving toward the ground. Faster, faster, and faster. Nearly 200 miles per hour as she pulls up. Now she'll run out of airspeed. And back it up. This is a tail slide. Three, three and a half lengths of the airplane. At 70 miles an hour backwards, she flops it out and recovers inverted. Upside down, all the blood wants to rush to her head. Oh my goodness, that is just so, so, so hard on the body. Negative Gs, when all the blood is actually forced up into your head, what happens to the body is that you actually begin to see red because the, so much blood gets into your eyes and into your retinas 
is that you begin to see a lot of red, and if you continue that too much, too hard, you will virtually red out, and you will not be able to see anything but red. Thank you. 